2019 continues, uh, your helmet stay on the practice? We had a um, great discussion. The deal was from Bronner. If I can get uh, Ryan Fitzpatrick on the phone and get some pointers, then I can keep it. By Thursday, <coughs> Thursday the due date, so I've been working on that. Tommy said, and Tommy's got Kasicki, he's got inside man, so I think it's going to go good, good for me. <laughs> Speaking of Tommy, he, he talked to us about when you took your official visit to Penn State, that he ended up hosting you. So this relationship goes back a little bit. Tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, um, I mean, I, when Moorhead gave us a call, he's talking about, hey, we know you're not really highly recruited right now. Um, just come up. And I really didn't know anybody in the roster at all. I mean, I'm maybe Trace and Saquon, the people I had heard about. But met Tommy, and then oh, we just kind of hit off from there. And uh, that's, where, that's where I really started to get to know him. When you went back and watched the film of yourself this past weekend, what did you think? You know, what was your performance like? Um, I, I did. I thought I did pretty fairly well for stepping in, but there's always some. There's always plays you wish you could have back, and I definitely I threw some balls behind some people, but I made some plays and um, got it corrected and um, had a good practice today. So, talking to Tommy, he was saying how you know having that balanced offense and having Colin behind you sort of opens things up a little bit. How much did you see that? And I guess I mean I, I know it was you know ten throws and all that, but. How much does it help having a running back like that behind you? Oh, it makes it easy. I mean, we, we always had a 50-yard drive, and I just threw the ball once. So, I mean, having an off, a good running back really takes the pressure off the quarterback. It doesn't matter who's in there. The would-be touchdown to Osiris. What was going through your head on that play? It looked like the ball was placed perfectly. I guess he just lost in the sun. I thought I missed him at first. And I was like, I was like, look at the sun. I was like, was it inside? And they just shot, they just shot the thumbs off at me. I was like, okay. Mind. This offensive line group's played some musical chairs, and, and you got a chance to kind of get behind that. What, you know, what's it like, confidence-wise, to get out there knowing you've got several guys that can play up and down the line? It's good. It, I mean, it makes you more comfortable back there dropping back when you have a bunch of depth and any guys guys that can play anywhere on the line, and especially the experience as far as the older guys. They know what they're doing. They know what to look for. Maybe if you miss a call here or there or, like, miss a protection, they'll definitely uh, cover it up for you. If you have to start on Saturday, just how confident and how comfortable would you be in that position? Um, I'll be ready to go. I mean, we're, we're hoping Tommy's ready to go. But um, if not, and, uh, we'll see what, uh, what happens. But um, he should be – hopefully he's ready to go. But if not, then, then I'll step in there. I'll, I'll be just as comfortable and uh, ready to produce just like he did last weekend. What's it like for you mentally sort of being in that weird position? You don't know if you're going to get your first career start. It could happen, but then – Again, like you said, Tommy could be healthy and it could be him. Just what's it like for you? Um, I haven't really thought about that. I'm just worried about executing the game plan and getting each day right to practice. And um, I had a good practice, pretty good practice today for best Tuesday practice of the year so far. And uh, I'm just taking it play by play. I'm not really looking forward to that. We'll, that's that's out of my control. So just getting the game plan right, just being ready. And my name's number is called. I know it's a little cliche, but how nice is it to have had some game reps under your belt now, going into a week where you may end up starting. It was good. I mean, any experience is a good experience. So, I mean, I'm glad I got in, but I hate the, the situation that it came came from. So, I mean, but I, even if I don't, I'll, I'll be ready. I'll always be ready as far as game plan goes. So.